morning everybody to another day on the uh, site putting up the uh, commercial pole barn here and uh, something interesting for you guys you see something different here normally uh, if you're put up, putting up a pole barn you've seen that uh, usually you just use an auger truck drill down and uh, pour your concrete post but what you see here is not normally seen and that is a trench going all the way around the building so the decision was made when we were going that we were hitting some real rocky soil. You could see that when we were doing our site prep here, which I showed you in another video. So we thought we'd save time with that auger truck trying to get down through this stuff and instead just trench the entire outside. We're going to have to put, uh, you know, there's insulation board that goes down uh, uh, here anyway, so we would have had a small trench anyways. So we just made a bigger trench. You could see the building inspector wanted us to have 30 inch tubes for the front and the back of the building. Uh, 24 for the side for the weight uh, capacity here and uh, and then we just drop tubes down in and uh, put a concrete base in it and then the posts will get set on those and uh, we'll go from there this will all get backfilled uh, you see a bunch of pipe there we're going to be running the uh, drain pipes down right in here anyways so we if we didn't have that trench we would have had to put it in for the insulation and if we wanted the drain under under uh under the front of the ground here we would have had a trench for that uh as well so kind of saving you know how they say killing two birds with one stone i guess and uh you see all this i was also going to show you how this came out over here a lot of times uh, if you're doing a commercial building you may want to have a loading dock and uh how does that work in a pole building uh very simple over here is going to be the loading dock and you can see that uh it was uh, poured concrete all set right around the corner we want it in the corner so i believe this length here is 20 foot if i'm not mistaken and i believe that over there is about 12. this was going to come out 12 and then we ended up kicking it out a little and with a little wing there because our trucks will uh pull in from the road come over here we built a runway they'll be able to pull up there to then back into the dock here and so when they're back here you know the front of the tractor is probably going to be way out here so then when they make the left to pull that wing so they don't hit that uh, thing this is a slight uh decline back into the building i can't remember what the grade was offhand um yeah i don't remember to tell you what that grade was but it's very very slight and there'll be some drain in there so uh so that's a concrete corner for a dock and then the rest will be all regular like you've uh, seen in other videos with the pole barn style just trenched instead so uh, things are coming together guys hope that uh, shows you something new all right have a great day